Well, hey there, YouTube. I know I've got a several out here. I want you to go out there and take a look at. Uh, they're, of course, creating the weather out there. And the snowstorm we're going to get all day today. They've got the entire United States here decked out. Uh, so you can't really see up. But what I've noticed was a very bright line that was showing through the clouds of where I am at right over here. And uh, I think that's common icing, guys, um, for sure. Uh, I just went outside and that bright line was even brighter and longer and uh, and I looked at the night sky app that I have and there's nothing up there they should be leaving a big bright line across my sky while I look straight up and uh, it's in the uh, straight up more in the uh, uh, north to northwest I'm not quite sure where you guys are at I'm right smack dab in the middle of the United States but I am going to go ahead and put myself out there to say that Comet Ison is visible in the night sky and it is alive and it is well and it is right over our heads folks it's it's inbound and uh, so if you get a chance you know even if you think it's cloudy out there right now would be a good time to go take a look I mean right now I saw it uh, at 9:44 p.m when the sun was completely down and I saw it shining through the clouds and it moved uh, from the uh, south to the north but you know uh, probably not all that much uh, but the line got longer as the night went on as the clouds I think kind of thinned out as the uh, snow has even yet to fall here so uh, they predict a snowfall all night starting at midnight and it still hasn't fallen yet it's 5 a.m. I've been staying up all night tracking these storms and uh, tracking what's going on in our solar weather and I saw uh, Comet Ison. okay guys it's up there so uh, and it's undeniable okay I'm not gonna go out there and say uh, uh, go out there and look when you're not gonna see something you will find it it is there I'm ahead of BP Earthwatch I'm ahead of uh, suspicious observers uh, none of them were stating that you'd be able to see it in your in your sky with your naked eye but lo and behold it is there I think they're trying to block it out so you cannot see it and uh, and with the space weather as well that's going on we're getting uh, bow shocks from both sides of our planet uh, when it comes to these CMEs, so we're getting pressure from one side and then from the other and more from the opposite side of the sun, which is very weird as well, folks. So there's something going on out there in space, and I know what I saw up there was definitely comedizing. It's right where it should be, and uh, maybe a little uh, ahead of time. Uh, there's been some speculation about the uh, actual speed of Ison and tracking of Ison as what you may see out there are actual only models they're not uh, uh, actual positions so uh, I would recommend that you get out there at night uh, and take a look uh, depending on where you're at I'm in the middle you know like I said in Iowa I look straight up there it is undeniable and it's not even on the news um, they're just talking about the snowfall here as you can see I'm dressed warm to stand out there because it is just unbelievable I just wonder what it would look like on a clear sky but I'm seeing this through the cloud deck okay I am seeing this through the clouds I can see uh, the other bright brighter stars that are kind of penetrating through but this is definitely a real long tailed uh, uh, it's a comet. It's comet icing, guys. So go out there and check it out for yourself. Thumb me up, thumb me down. And, uh, you know, tell me where what you think, uh, what you're seeing, too. I'd really like to know, folks, because that's what I'm seeing. It's right where it should be at. Take care, guys.